Crazy stuff, man. Crazy stuff. All right, let's check out my man Tyler because he's been left out. The dark. He's been left out for a while. Almost the entire country is now without water and electricity services. The army has been mobilized to help provide shelter and basic necessities, but the cold and snow have hampered ground movement, and storms have shut down every airport in the country. Damn. Scientists are still unable to fully explain the reason behind the cold wave, which has now gripped the entire planet. Temperatures continue to fall everywhere in the world as authorities ponder. Well, our job is done. Now it's up to the army to do what they can to help the population. Carla, you should get some sleep. You haven't closed your eyes in two days. I have to get warm to do that. I'm solid ice from head to toe. Yeah. Hey, look, can I get real with you here for a sec, Carla? I think it's probably now or never. I get the feeling you're hiding something from me on this cane thing. Am I right? Oh, yeah, you're right. I found him. But I think he's innocent. I didn't say anything because I didn't want to get you involved, Tyler. You mad at me? Nah, of course not. Plus, with everything that's going on now, I guess it doesn't really matter. Anyway, as long as you do what you think is right, you can't go too wrong. <laughs> Yeah, come you boy. Hey! It's my girlfriend. Let's see what's going on here. What's she getting here for? Sam, what are you doing here, babe? There's a train leaving in one hour for Florida. It'll probably be the last one for a long time. I'll be on it, Tyler. With or without you. If you really love me, quit the police and come with me. When this cold stops, we'll get on with our lives. Our new, normal lives. It's time to make a choice, Tyler. Oh boy, this is toughy. It took me a long time to figure out who I was and where I belong, Sam. But now I know. I know there are people who need help and who are counting on me. My place is here with them. Whoa, what? I feel like I'm a part of something good here. I love you, Sam. Wait! What's gonna happen on this planet? But uh, I wish you luck, Tyler. Wait, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to press the go with wait, stupid mouse. I hate you. Look what you did. You made me go dog. Oh, God. Okay, I definitely pressed the other direction. I did not press to. Oh, fuck this mouse. Ah. I'm gonna go help Jeffrey and Doug. They're heading down to take a look in the southern sector to make sure everybody's out of there. Tyler. As long as you do what you think is right, you can't go too wrong. Good luck to you, Carla. I don't know how all this is gonna end up, but I hope it all works out for you. Uh oh. Founder. That picture, remember that. I am so mad I fucked the Tyler's ending. Damn it. I must really screw me over. Anyway. Here we are. Are you sure you know what you're doing? The Oracle's seen the child, just like I did. He'll be here to find her any minute now. I've got to get to her before he does. Wait for me here. I won't be long. Let's go. There's no time to lose. I've got to find that girl before the Oracle does. Okay, remember that picture.
sir. Sir, you can't go in there. Yeah, I see you later. Got to do this quickly. The orc will be here any second. Right, there's the picture right there, so that means she's in this door. No, it's not her. No, she's not the one. Crap. I think it's... was it this one then? There she is. I got her. You can't go it. Damn. I've seen you in my dreams. You have to come with me. We have to leave here right now. She seems out of it, like she's not here at all. Uh -oh. So, I see you're still alive. I don't know how you've managed it. But that's of no importance now. Give me the child, and I will grant you a rapid death. If you take her to the ones you serve, they'll use her to make slaves out of the entire human race. That's no concern of yours. You'll be dead before that comes to pass. Give Dude, me Dude, I died already. I don't have time to play with you. Uh, okay. Gotta go. I was at the wrong way there. Wow, that was kind of scary. I went the wrong way. Oh! You know what? Fuck this. I'm leaving you here. You mustn't move, understand? I'll be back soon to get you. I hope. No, I know. Urk, we got this coming for a long time. That bitch, your ass rocked. Your ass. Oh, uh, oh. Oh, my. Oh. Ooh, that's close. Oh, you gotta be a punk and just use weapons now, huh? Alright, come on. Come on, man. 
Oh, look, it's good, man. Nah. Dude, oh, oh, God. Too many times. Come on. Or the reign of ice, of terror and death. We were right to have chosen you. We? Whose side are you on, Agatha? Who are you, really? We wish to keep the Orange Clan from possessing the child. They would use her to tighten their grip on humanity. We wish to provide her with a safe, hidden home where no one can ever use her for evil ends. Um... You. You've been using me from the start, haven't you? You manipulated me so I'd find the girl for you. Manipulated isn't really the word. Let's say, guided. We intervened to protect you because we knew you could lead us to her. What happened at the amusement park? I don't remember anything after the roller coaster collapsed. You didn't survive the fall. We found your body, and we resuscitated you. The truth is that you are dead, Lucas. What? It's... it's impossible. I, I, I'm not dead. Life, death, they're simply abstract notions. You gave your life so that humanity could survive. You are a hero, Lucas. Why, thank you. It was vital that you bring us the indigo child, and you succeeded. Now we can put her in a safe place. Did you hear that? You accomplished your mission well. No. No, I don't trust you. Jade stays with me. You're committing a fatal error, Lucas. I'm going to have to eliminate you. Oh, shit. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? I forgot one small detail. When we brought you back to life, we added a module within your cortex. It's impossible to kill you, as you are already dead. I can, however, annihilate you. Oh god, I hate fighting this guy. And you will be erased forever. Yeah, here we go, this time we does all the time. Trying to resist. I have control of you now. Here we go. Resist, food, resist! Come 
Come on. Turn around, Lucas. You got it. Yeah! Get up, Lucas! Hurry! Quickly! Over here! What the? on their face. How did you find me? That man came and got me. He told me you needed help. Do you know who that man is? I have no idea. He just told me we had to follow him. Weird. So, what do we do now? Looks like we don't have much choice. Let's follow him. Lucas, you're safe and sound. Marcus, how did you end up here? They came looking for me. They explained everything, Lucas. I know now that you weren't crazy. I hope that you can forgive me for doubting you. I couldn't possibly have known that you were really... What are you talking about? Our host will explain everything. Hey, does he look familiar? Welcome to the Camp of the Invisibles, Lucas. Come and take a seat by the fire. Yeah, exactly. It's that Bobo from the very beginning of the game. We remember him. Mr. Bogard. You call yourself the Invisibles? Many of us are homeless. Though we're scattered throughout every city, no one ever notices us. This allows us to see without being seen. Pursue mm. our mission without attracting attention. Uh, jeez. You're the ones who sent me that email on Kirsten, aren't you? And normally, we never intervene directly, but it seemed necessary to help you see that Lucas wasn't really guilty of murder. Interesting. We thought that you might ultimately help him in his mission. What do you know about the Chroma? It's a natural energy force, like gravity or magnetism, but it is infinitely more powerful. This force is in you, Lucas, and you've only discovered the smallest part of it. Interesting. 
Uh, Orange Clan. Who is really behind the Orange Clan? Nobody knows for sure. It's said that there are five. Five to control the world. Administration, police, army, finance, the media. They control everything. Over the centuries, the Orange Clan has built an empire that runs the entire world. What do you know about the clans? The clans have existed for thousands of years. They reunited the most powerful of beings, who then provided the secret of the prophecy. They have only one goal, obtaining ultimate power by seizing the child. What is the message of the prophecy? It announces the birth of the indigo child. The child have the answer to all questions. And the one who hears her message will have access to infinite power. But if the child has not been heard before the final countdown, humanity will cease to exist. Well, no pressure. So, what do we do now? We must bring the indigo child to a source of the Krona. That's where she'll deliver her message and complete the prophecy. Where do we find this chromosaurus? There are only three known to exist on the planet. The closest can be found on an old military base called Wishida. Wishida? That's where I was born. My parents were scientists. They were working for the government. Yeah, and that explains many things. In the 50s, an artifact was discovered that was not of human origin. It turned out to be a chroma source. We must bring the indigo child there as quickly as possible, before she wastes away and dies without having delivered her message. When do we leave? In two hours. The time it'll take to finish preparations on your vehicle and to find you enough gasoline. It seems likely that the orange and purple clans will be waiting for you at Wishida. They will stop at nothing to prevent you from uniting the child with artifact. We will take care of the child and give her a bit of chroma to help her hang on. There are some mattresses in the wagon back there. I suggest you get some rest before you have to leave. You have a long journey ahead of you. Tomorrow may well be the last day of the human race. Wow. Again, no pressure or anything. I'm dead tired, Carla. I'm gonna take Bogart's advice and get some sleep. I don't think I can sleep right now. I'm gonna wander around a bit and join you later. <laughs>